Hi everyone, it's Robin. It's been quite a while since I posted a video, probably about six weeks I imagine. Um, I had gone to the States on a family emergency. My grandmother had passed away, so that was really, really hard, but um, I was able to be there with her, you know, by her bedside for for a day and a half before she um, before she passed. So that was, I was glad I was able to go, but um, so I was there for three weeks, uh, just spending time with family, which was really, really nice. I hadn't seen them in a couple of years, so that was really, really nice. I can't even tell you how nice. Um, but then, you know, I came back, and I've just been struggling with getting in my craft room. We have a lot going on right now. Um, we have our, my son, or our son, is about to graduate, which is really exciting, but and it's kind of a bittersweet thing because... I know that he's going to be going to college in the autumn, so me as a mom, just kind of trying to cut those apron strings um, has been a little hard, um, and I know we still have the whole summer with him, but uh, leading up to that, we're trying to finish school, and uh, well, before we leave for the States on April 26th, so, and then we'll be gone all summer from here, from Ireland. So then, um, b which means we'll have to pack up everything and put it in storage, which we're doing right now. So just coming back from the States on a really unexpected trip and then trying to finish up school with all three kids so they don't have to do any school um, in, in America when we get there and just graduation stuff and packing. So it's just been, all that to say, a minute and 50 seconds later, it's just been very, very busy around our house. So uh, I have missed you guys. Um, I've, I've tried to watch some videos since I've been back, but like I said, it's just been busy, but um, I've missed you so much. So all that uh, brings me to the video today. I wanted to be able to share with you some of the wonderful new stamps I got for my break for stamps I haven't been able to share with you yet. I got them actually in February, so nearly, um, well, last month actually, uh, the middle of last month. So... Um, these are the stamps that I got, and then, like I said uh, before in other videos, all these stamps are available through iBreak for Stamps at a 10% discount to you if you use my discount code, SAVE10ROBIN. So um, if you like them, um, I'll have the link below. So these are the Swalk stamps. I love them. They're so cute, and they're so fun to color with your markers. So this one is um, called Thinking of You and Sunshine. Um, old friend, sorry about the glare, uh, best dad, this is a really good one for Father's Day. And then I think I might have shown you this before, friends like you, and thinking of you, and it's so cute because you can put these little sentiments inside the little banner, or the little sign they have. So those are the Swalk ones that I got, and then I got loads more, all these, and then what this looks like. I just printed it from the website, so it's, you know, the pixels aren't, aren't the best quality, but, um, well, my printer, actually. So this is what this one looks like, and this is IBFS RB27, so if you have any um, uh, babies on the way, in friends or family or otherwise, uh, this is a really cute stamp. I love that, that little um, pram or stroller. It's really cute. So, and then this little one here, this little girl, let me show you that one. This one actually looks like that. So she's got a watering can and she says, A sprinkle of love makes friendship grow. So sweet. And then while I have this one out, I might as well just show you, let me see. I said I have tons of them. That's this one, so you can see it compared to my hand. And then that's this one here. And then this Valentine's Day one is this one, so it's quite big. That's that one. And um, these Easter ones are also on here. Um, there's the Easter basket, which is right there. Uh, floppy ear bunny, right there. Did I do that already? No, I did that one for a different one. That was for actually that one. Sorry about that. And then this nice sentiment called, uh, that says Easter blessings is right here. I know the glare isn't letting you see any of this, but I already have them in the, the bags. And then these are really, really nice. Um, <clears throat> again, the, my print quality isn't very good, but they're little collage stamps. This one's Beloved. This is the smaller one. And then this one, Beloved. And it's got the, 
the flower in the center here. And then, uh, I don't know if you can see this, the butterfly in the, this one, I love that. And the bird. And then, um, I guess it was this way, sorry. And then there's those two. So these are all brand new releases right here from I Write for Stamps. And then um, this one's one of the small collage ones. Okay, so I think that's all the stamps. But I wanted to show you this as well. This is so neat. This is a circle mini album. It's made of acrylic. Well, it's it's chipboard. It's black chipboard. This is what it looks like. You get, this. basically this is what comes in the packaging. You get three sets of pages, which this is all one set of pages right here. And then this obviously is the acrylic. You peel this back. Um, and I've done most of it, but um, so you peel back both sides of the acrylic and you can, I'll show you what this does in just a second. It's so neat. <clears throat> so what, the way it assembles is like this. You would uh, add your wet glue around the edge here and then you would line up these holes just like this. I know it might be a little hard to see. And then you peel off your blue uh, protective cover and then, oops, sorry, this goes like this. And then, of course, these are your handles. And then you would put this on top. And then, of course, put your wet adhesive again around the edges. Being careful not to get inside the area um, the, where the, the space is at. So this is like such a neat concept. So basically, it ends up being six pages um, with a slider. It's so neat. And then you can leave. I haven't got mine decorated yet, but I got the first couple of pages. And you can leave the acrylic or you can cover it with patterned paper. And it's so neat. It won't it won't um it won't pull out. So you can have photos here, here. Now this isn't my cover. Actually this one is my cover, so I haven't got it finished yet, but this is what my cover will look like. Um it'll look like that. And then like I put a a frame or something on it and I have some American craft stickers that I'm going to add to the cover but I need to get it all assembled and then um, just some lots of family pictures I'm going to put in here um, but let me just show you just what I do have done and I haven't decorated anything but I wanted to be able to share it with you so that's one and then it slides out this way and then this one these are all Webster's pages this one um, uh, has it where you know I, I just can decorate around here I was going to say I left the acrylic, but I did I did just mat, a, you know, put a photo mat and you can see the acrylic. But you could leave it completely clear and just add your photos. So it's such a neat concept. And this is at, um, I, it, available at iBreak for Stamps as well. So, um, and you can save again 10% by using my discount code SAVE10ROBIN. So I know I always like to save money, so I like to be able to share that with you so that you can as well. Um, but it's good to be back and I don't know how, um, how frequently I'll be able to post between now and, and, uh, you know, mid April because we will be packing and doing school and everything, but I have so much to share with you. I, I just, I look forward to it and, uh, I will be back hopefully again very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.